Hello everyone, this is Dan DeSantos. Welcome to another Muddy Colors book review. Today we're going to talk about the work of Steve Houston. And uh, I'll apologize in advance if we can't fit everything in the frame here. This is actually a rather large book and I'm having trouble even getting the camera to fill it all. This is an 11 by 17 book. Um, as far as I know, it's the only book available on Steve Houston's work. Uh, and it's part of a series called the World Famous Contemporary Painter Series. This is a small series of books that's produced by a Chinese fine art press. Uh, I'm not even going to attempt to say their name because I'm sure I'll butcher it. But there's quite a few artists represented in the series that um, might not have monographs elsewhere. You know, if you're lucky enough, you could hunt down a Bernie Fuchs version. Uh, Kent Williams has one. Uh, and Steve Houston. And as far as I know, this is the only way to get a real copy of his work. If you're unfamiliar, Steve Houston used to be an illustrator uh, and is a longtime educator. Uh, I'm actually probably going to be posting another video in tandem with this one talking about some of his education stuff. And he's a fine artist. Uh, if you like artists like Phil Hale or Frank Bellows from the Ashcan School, you'd probably like a lot of Steve's work. It's really energetic, beautifully painted oil paintings, uh, and most of it is focusing on the human male form. This book is not difficult to find. I believe I found this on Amazon, uh, despite it being a Chinese printing. Uh, and shipping is rather cheap, actually. I think you can get this book probably for about $20 or so, uh, which, considering its size, is uh, pretty good. The book isn't particularly long. It's only 48 pages, or I should say 48 plates. Uh, and of those 48 plates, you're probably representing about 44 paintings or so. And then there's some detail shots. This is a beautiful piece in particular. Um, you know, I'd say the only downside to this book, aside from its brevity, is that a few of the reproductions probably have no real business being in this book. There's a couple pieces that are really very pixelated to begin with, and then there's even a few where they zoom in and show you a detail of that already pixelated piece. But I'd say that flaw really only kind of, you know, affects maybe four or five pieces throughout the whole book. And all the rest are actually pretty spectacular reproductions, so it's not much to complain about. But if you can, take a look at this book, Steve Houston, World Famous Contemporary Painter Series. Uh, you can see the press down here. I'll type that into the comments section below so you can see it. And you can find this book on Amazon for about $20. It does have an awful lot of stickers in my copy. I decided to leave them here to show you the condition of the book you could expect. Uh, but check it out, Steve Houston.